First at noon, a family is grieving and three children are now without their mother after police say she was shot and killed. The shooting happened overnight at an apartment complex in Hollywood. And police are just beginning their investigation into who pulled the trigger. CBS 4's Riel Creighton is live near the scene in Hollywood with reaction from the family. Riel. But Lauren and Mary Bell, people wept on the complex, on this uh, balcony here at this apartment complex as detectives went in and out of the building. What police will tell us is that a woman was shot here and pronounced dead on the scene. Family members describe her as a mother of three, and they say she'd been dating a man for a few months, and that is who they believe is responsible. A woman tries to catch her breath outside of a Hollywood apartment where she says she just learned her sister had been murdered. I just know that I lost a little sister. I, I don't really know what happened. Um, she got shot from what I'm being told. I'm not sure if it was an altercation or what, but I lost a little sister. Detectives swarmed the building near South 56th Ave in Washington Street. Hollywood police said the call came in at 4.30 in the morning. They did see uh, a 30 year old black female. The caller that called 911 stated that they did hear gunshots. Cops confirmed a deadly shooting, but little else. But several family members identified the victim as Coretta Bain, seen here in a picture from her Facebook page, a mother who'd recently turned her life around. She was a postal worker. She was a good girl. I mean, she got three daughters. And I have to get out and go explain that their mom is not waking up. She's not going to be back home. So. While police couldn't say if they're looking for a suspect, by early morning, the family was united in pointing the finger at a man who Bain had been dating, claiming he fled in her car after the shooting. Her sister, desperate for someone to stop him. It shot her cold blood and left her and her stuff left in her vehicle. She just recently got the car. It's clean. It doesn't have any scratches on it. Um, it has dark tints. So if you see it, please, please. Yeah, the family is desperate. They have named that boyfriend as the suspect, but police have yet to name a suspect or put out a description on the vehicle. What they are both asking for, though, is for anyone with information to give police a call. If you know anything, the number to Crime Stoppers is 305-471-TIPS. We're live in Hollywood this morning. Riel Creighton, CBS 4 News.